Welcome back to your favourite game and mine. We're back in War Thunder and we've done it. We have finally done it. We have ground and we have ground and we have ground. And now we have got the R3 lunchbox. We have actually got it. Look at this, isn't it magnificent in its annoying speed and mobility and fully automatic 20mm Orican cannon. Um, this thing has killed me so many times just by being sneaky. So I wanted to get make some videos on it and uh, see how much fun it actually is. I've not actually driven this in anger. I had a little bit of a test drive to see what it was like. And this is completely bog standard, unresearched. I've not got any modifications to it or anything. It's, it's just as it comes. I'm looking forward to getting some armour piercing shells. They would be nice. But uh, yes, that's for the plan. So we're going to go and try and annoy some big tanks with our <laughs> lunch boxiness. Stay tuned. Now, I know you hate this vehicle, I hate this vehicle, everyone hates this vehicle, but it seems like so much fun, I've got to try it. I've even fitted the uh, War Thunder Snail on the back, just to add insult to injury. Now, there's another R3 there, fellow R3, he's got a bush on the front of his, good lad. Let's see what this actual thing is, I mean the cannon is pretty pretty, pretty nifty. We've got five, five sets of 120 round belts, which would be nice. And I've also put the red bit on the back to show where to shoot me, even though any shoot me anywhere will kill me. <laughs> because things and stuff and things. I'll be with the R3 brigade, look at this. <laughs> there's three of us. <laughs> I think it's an M10. I think it's an M10. Is it? Well, that was uh, unsuccessful. <laughs> we have annoyed him and now we shall get out of the way <laughs> sending some shells our way and some machine gun fire <laughs> nope do not shoot me <laughs> don't just call me <laughs> R3 gank <laughs> well we didn't kill him because we're at ooh Saw that coming through. I'm glad we are manoeuvrable. <laughs> that was a mistake to make. <laughs> oh, my fellow R3s, help me out. I'm sure I saw someone going down here. That's why I'm using... Oh, fellow R3 over there. And reload. He's using his speed. That's, am I playing this wrong? I don't know. Should I be whizzing in like they do? I don't know. This is weird. Yeah, come on. He doesn't need that track. <laughs> <laughs> they hate it so much already. Ooh, hello. There's one over here. No machine guns, no. Oh. <laughs> oh, it's so hated. That was my first outing. I didn't get a kill, but I annoyed a T34 like hell and a M10, I think, as well. So let's uh, R3 up the side of the hill because this is what we do. And down the other side, there we go. <laughs> Saw some shots going in there, were they aimed at me or just 
in general. They could be uh, arty, I suppose. Ooh. Oh, tree. You've killed me. You've killed me, tree. <laughs> You've killed me. Hang out. <laughs> when you're looking down the barrel of your gun um, and not looking where you're going, that's how you die. So, yes, a little, little, little tip there. So let's, let's see if we can R3 over here. Are you ready? R3 maneuver. Go! Yee! <laughs> My fellow R3 is loving me, apparently. What the hell's going on there? Really? A clipped a fence, a wooden fence. I still got some air though, so there you go. So I did a bit of misery. It stopped. Oh, that was not a. Thanks, dude. How did I get injured then? Honestly, dude. Did you shoot me? Or did someone else shoot me? I don't know. This guy's crazy. Thank you, dude. <laughs> you don't need those tracks. Oh, bad for you. You don't need them. Let's try and get you. Oh, there's another guy over there. Oh, the Panzer here as well. <laughs> this could be interesting. Reload me, baby. Sounds awesome inside. <laughs> yeah, I can really do. Oh! Uh, oh my goodness. Thank you, big gun boy. We haven't did long range. The recoil on these things are big. <laughs> No, stay in the ditch, stay in the ditch. <laughs> yeah, this thing recalls like a mother hubbard. No, no, please don't do that. Oh, I'm sideways on. I'm trying to get an angle on him where he can't shoot me and I might actually get a chance of a pen but apparently I can't do that so I'm <laughs> going out of here oh I don't have oh no I'm gonna burn to death I can't even see him he's over there somewhere he shot me through the building why do people keep shooting me through buildings that shouldn't be allowed a building um I could deal with some fire extinguisher but I've not researched that bit yet uh, guys, you might want to get out of this vehicle's on fire. <laughs> Shooting the crap out of the road, though. Ow. <laughs> That's my good as well. This thing's taking some hits. I'm quite impressed. There we go. <laughs> okay. I'll get to you straight. For those people who have been shooting at me with these things all the time and playing them and I was shouting at you, I apologise. I can see why you do it now. It is quite good fun. Uh, with armour piercing, this thing would be pretty lethal. But it is waffle thin, so you know, it's a compromise. Put this gun on top of a tank war thunder. I don't know if one actually exists with a Orlikan cannon on the front, but it should do. Give me an armoured vehicle with this on, it'd be awesome. And if you haven't built one already, build one for actual war, because... Damn! Perhaps don't put a snail on the back of it though, an ironic Sydney snail, because you know it's not exactly the best camouflage that is it. <laughs> Look at that stug going. Is that stug got a turbo on his engine or what? Go stuggy stuggy. I'm gonna need to upgrade the uh, the wheels and the engine and everything else as well, but damn if this thing's not fun. Now this is kind of sniper alley a bit here. A little bit. It's 
Stucky, what are you doing? Stucky's hiding. Stucky, don't hide. Be proud of your stuckiness. Show it to the world, your flat face and your surprisingly accurate cannon. Okay, we're getting snipped from over there then. I mean, technically, I suppose this is a. Uh, oh, trees. Look where you're going, David, honestly. <laughs> yeah, I mean, this is a scout vehicle. This is not like an attack vehicle, surely. So I'm going to have to research to get some scouting stuff. Because this thing, you just scout all day with it. It would be hilarious. Ooh, don't roll, don't roll, don't roll. We shall use this ditch and hopefully these trees to our advantage slightly. Right. Ah! Oh, there's a guy. <laughs> oh, I thought I was a kill. That's not, that's a capture. <laughs> Reload! I should have pinged him on people's radar, surely. Ooh, I don't think so. That's not a nice thing to do. Kill this, that'll do. <laughs> we need to go kill this thing, though, honestly. Is that a guy over there as well? It's hard to tell. Let's go and hide behind this guy over here. Aha! That's a pile of rocks. Damn it, War Thunder, stop making rocks look like tanks. Can okay, we see a guy? Dead tank, dead tank, dead tank. We've got A and B, I don't think they're bothered about A. Mm, right, okay. Well, this vehicle is not about sick and sniping, so we're going to move down the tree line, I think. Who knows? Someone might shoot at us and... Enemy aircraft? Enemy aircraft? No enemy aircraft. Leave me alone. Oh, I see him. He's over there. That's fine. Oh. Learn to drive, David, honestly. <laughs> Give away position much. <laughs> I need a road up here, I might go faster on the road. It's a bit risky, but you know. Why not? We could could we anti air? I suppose we could. The recall I think dunk. And there goes 120 shells. And he knows we're here, and we're moving. We are definitely moving. <laughs> we do not want to annoy the aircraft any more than we have. Uh, ditch here. I think we're going to have to use the terrain to our advantage quite a bit in this vehicle. Guy just over there, over the hill. Oh, just popping loads of smoke or something. What's that going on? Is that plane guy? I saw that plane. He's over there. That's fine. It's a little bit risky. Oh, damn tree! He's <laughs> like tanks as well. Damn it! All. You think our job's harder for this? Now we are actually out in the open now. Quite close to their spawn as well. I don't intend on going to their spawn, but... Oh, crap. Armoured car. <laughs> I thought it was a tank then. It's not an armoured car. You eat things. And we we have achieved our goal of anti-tanking. Well, it's got a kill. Armoured car counts. 
this is their spawn point so well it's, their spawns just to our left here so we don't want to be here very much that guy's actually dead now that guy Oh, mama. We don't want to be here. <laughs> Somebody hit. Look, my barrel is bent. <laughs> we don't want to be here. Let's go and find somewhere to hide so we can actually repair our bent <laughs> gun. Whoever <laughs> shot that. Genius. Cracking shot that. Or lass. Or whoever. Oh. Um, let's hope it doesn't take too long to fix because the guy right there I want to shoot. Hopefully he doesn't see me because he's not looking this way. Hopefully. Oh my god, there's people everywhere. Fix. Oh, what did I just do? What did I just do? They did an update patch weird thing. <laughs> it's so dangerous. It's supposed to give me time, surely, don't they? It's just, just, just titivating, okay. Oh my god, my bent barrel is shamefully bent. Uh, the guy over there, you can see him moving, you can see his turret. There's a flak truck over here, maybe? I don't know. Oh, we're fixed. We're fixed. Apparently, we're fixed, even though my barrel's still bent. I'm not going to ask any questions about my bent bow. <laughs> as long as it shoots straight, that's uh, M4, that's mine. That is also mine, it's a verbally do. That's fine, okay. That's a Stuka. We don't want that guy. Ooh, learn to drive, honestly, this thing's all over the shop. Oh crap! Move. 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 No. No shot there. <laughs> I didn't even know that guy was there. Uh, I know I said the mission goal was to get a kill, but it's actually really good fun. I'm sorry to say. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to all the R3 owners I've been swearing at. All you angry lunchboxes. I'm sorry. It's really good fun. I'm going to be playing some more of this, I think. But uh, let's, let's see what else we can do. One last mission. You know what it's like in Warthunda. Just one more game. Someone told me to chill. Holy shit, apparently. Because <laughs> I went a bit too far. We are R3. And I'm hoping I don't come against another tank. Because this thing without armor piercing is not brilliant up close. I heard something very close. That guy. <laughs> No, Valley, no! Uh, oh. <laughs> well, folks, there you have it. Uh, my first drive of the R3 in anger. As I keep saying in the video, I'm sorry for having to go with people driving these things. They are good fun. Uh, they are bullet magnets, but they're so much fun. Um, I got did our goal, mission goal, I got a kill um, if you class that as a kill, it was an armoured car that I was sneaking around at, but it still counts as a kill in my box. I hope you enjoyed this video, if you did, smash that like button for me and subscribe to the channel to help me out and help me produce more videos like this don't forget also to check out our social media pages up here um, to look behind the scenes when new videos are coming out and general social media stuff, you know how social media works, it's the modern day, everyone knows how social media works Thanks for joining me in this video and I hope to see you again next time. Remember, don't run into any trees or buildings, you'll die. And the R3 is a bullet magnet, but great fun. Thanks for joining me and I'll see you next time. Stay safe. Much love.